For some reason, they don't want to have cure of cancer. He had seven charts ready for me to review that had been reviewed by the National Cancer Institute, who also made a site visit the year before. The National Cancer Institute reported that these seven patients were either in complete remission or there was substantial improvement. Dr. Brzezinski had MRIs of brain tumors known to be almost universally fatal and it simply disappeared. A Polish native named Stanislaw Brzezinski attended Lublin Medical University where he graduated first in his class at age 24 and then received his PhD in biochemistry the following year. While undergoing his research to acquire his PhD, Dr. Brzezinski made a profound discovery. He found a strain of peptides in human blood and urine that had never before been recorded in biomedical research. As his curiosity in these peptides evolved, he made another profound observation. People who were inflicted with cancer seemed to lack these newly discovered peptides in both their blood and urine, while those who were healthy and free of cancer appeared to have an abundance of these peptides. Dr. Brzezinski theorized that if he could somehow provide a way to chemically extract these peptides from the blood and urine of healthy donors and administer these peptides to those with cancer, perhaps it could be useful in treating the disease.